A Christian poet stood before the king. As he was about to sing about God, the king stopped him and said, Poet, here's a challenge for you. Tell me, O king, I will do it for you, said the poet. You need to speak about the Bible and finish it by the time I throw this lemon into the air and catch it. The poet thought for a while. The Bible itself is contained in Old Testament and New Testament and it is vast to explain it. How do I shorten it? Still, he agreed to the challenge. O king, give me one week and I will try to execute it for you. The poet tried high and low for a week, breaking his head on how to make this a reality of explaining the Bible within that short period. He thought about it, meditated on it and prepared for it. Many heard about this incident that is going to take place and was eagerly waiting for it. Finally, the day came. The king requested him, Please, now sing to us. I shall throw this lemon into the air and catch it. By then, you have to completely speak about the Bible. By the time he threw the lemon and caught it, the poet sang and finished. He sang, Jesus won the sin of Adam on the cross. In about seven words, all of the Bible was hidden in it. To the confused crowd and the king, the poet explained, The first man whom God created was Adam. He was chased out of the Garden of Eden because of his disobedience. Sin entered the world through him. God sent his only son as a human to this world to save it. He is Jesus. He was crucified for our sins and shed blood to redeem us from eternal hell. And he rose on the third day by conquering death. That is how we got redemption. This is the Bible's core. Are we strongly rooted in the word of God to accept such challenges?